Hello there, Golf Freak here, and welcome back to my Let's Play of Civilization V as the Inca. Uh, where we last left off, I was building the Oracle as well as settling some cities. So we're going to see, and I'm going to get iron this next turn, so let's hope that there's some iron around where my cities are. Main Gardens was built far away. Do not wait to strike till it. Okay, so anything? Any iron? Anywhere nearby? Nope, 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 nope. No! Is there any iron to over here? Way the heck up there in the city state. Any iron down? Oh, iron on there. Yes! So we will have some iron when we settle the city down here. So this is definitely going to be a top priority. So you're done with that. I'll go ahead and continue building improvements around here. We want you to come up this way. Build a road. Um, we will need embark eventually, but we should probably get mathematics. Okay, build the farm. Next turn. And we are unhappy. Population has finally gotten too big. I'm not sure if we'll have enough gold to do this. But... Purchase... A workboat. I should have bought a tile first, but we can do it anyway. So buy the tile. Yep, I'm fully aware. And we, we are going to have to settle that city down low pretty quickly so that I can get access to the dyes and, uh, and silk. Unfortunately, I won't be able to sell those, but it will just help my happiness for my empire. Okay. Let's start the road. Oh, there's even more fishes out here. Oh, well. That's fine. I have access to the whales, and that's the major concern. Are we getting a social policy really soon? World's most literate people? Someone scientifically way ahead. Choose research. Uh, now we'll grab optics. Okay, hopefully we still get the Oracle. That would be really bad if we didn't. Adopt a policy. Uh, we were going to get Monarchy next, so this will help my unhappiness as well as uh, give me some extra gold. So we're going to grab this, and then we're going to start moving down up Piety. So as my capital goes up, so does everything else. So let's hope that my money is going to be good and hold out. How much is it costing me to run? Yeah, what for all these roads, it's costing me one gold. That is awesome. We made an instrument to know. Diplomacy status, defense, defense with America's run its course. We'll have to renew it. All right, next thing to get, uh, we're going to get currency. Now, actually, I'll probably have my great engineer if, if I eventually get one. I should eventually, really soon, I think. Now, next 20-ish turns, we'll have him rush that over in uh, Tiwakani, Tiwakanaku. However you would like to say that, I don't really care. Please build the orb. And Amit um, players entered the medieval era. Please get it, please get it, please get it. Sweet. So it'll give us some more great scientist points, which will be great. Um, okay, you're done with that. Come over here. Build a mine. Get one more road. Okay, our next policy. We're going to go down PAT next. Uh, yeah, we're not going to go down rationals. We want to get um, theocracy. 
So I want, I'm not going to have a ton of cities, but I want to have some big ones. Okay, finish the oracle. Okay, we will want to build something else relatively quickly. But I want to get my settler net, the settler out first, and then one more worker. At least one more worker, and then we'll worry about everything else after that. Okay, so stuff to Hiawatha has ended. So if that is true, and if he has money... Not much, but he does have a lot of gold per turn. I have plenty of ivory. Give me 50 gold, and that will be for my open borders. And then give me 20 gold per... no, 10 gold per turn. Um, how's this? Uh, fine. That's kind of a rip-off, but oh well. I might as well take it because I'm not going to get any other gold anyways. It's not going to do me any good just to keep it in my pocket. Okay, that's done. We got the trade route established. Sweet. Um, come on down here and build the camp. And we are going to speed this up slightly. We're going to go ahead and purchase the worker. Choose production. Finish the temple over here. And it's actually starting to get some good production going now. Um, yeah, build the Col you actually have really decent production. Build the Colossus. Next turn. Okay, come on up here. You are going to come. Okay, so it wants me to put the here. I don't want to do that because it'll interfere too much with my other city. And I would prefer it there because it'll have access to everything still. So. Okay, we want you over here helping out this city. Okay, Cusco can build something else. We'll have it build a temple so I can get some more culture coming in because I need more culture to help maintain the amount of uh, cities I have. Okay, uh, build road, and I'm doing building the roads manually just to make sure that they build it only on, uh, or as, ma as much as possible on hills. Farm. Next turn. Jew has grown. Cool. Okay, build a road. Next turn. Yep, found a city. And we're going to have you build a granary so you grow faster. Okay, and we definitely... Oh, we can fire on an enemy. Who are Spearmen? Eek. Come up here. It's a stalemate if you attack, so if you fortify, you should be better off. Is the you have no gold. To you. So, okay.
Better is bread with a happy heart than. Okay, so those spearmen did not attack. Looks like they ran away. So you guys continue to fortify there. They're going to go into the city and we're going to buy a couple of tiles. Not buildings, tiles. Okay, it's going to expand here in six turns. So that's good. We're going to go ahead and buy this tile then. And build the mine. Choose research. Um, we'll get horseback riding because it is the furthest one away, and I do have horses, so it's not a waste. Next turn. Not quite. Build a mine. Wow, it's already at level four. I must have a lot of food. Okay. Next turn. Is the following trade um, of interest? No, we're going to go alone, because you're probably just going to demand stuff from me. Great Lighthouse has been built far away, so Colossus is going to be tough to build in this amount of time, but I will get some gold out of it, so it won't be like a total rip. Alright, uh, we'll have you build the market next. Because Chith and Itza is so far ahead of... I um, should have technologically slung shot so far ahead of everybody else that no one will be able to build it for quite some time. I'm kind of hoping on that. Eek, I really need some happiness. Okay, so we got that, so what to get next? Well, let's go ahead and get theology for some more culture, which will always be welcome. Okay, come on over here. And build a road. Okay, you're done with this city for now. We're actually just going to have you automate. And I like my empire right now. I'm not going to be able to expand out here. It's going to be counterproductive, I think. I think I've got cities everywhere that I want. So I think this is going to be my empire, and we're going to figure out what kind of victory I should go for. And we have Machu build a library. Make sure everyone has a granary in a library before they do anything else. <sighs> so stuff from Washington has ended. Okay, build the camp here. So Washington, you still I dead trust broke. you are a friend to liberty. I got a little bit of gold. Better than nothing. Um, six gold per turn and thirty gold is how much? Um, hundred six times three is eighteen, so one hundred eighty. So is just over two hundred ten. It's got nothing else, but then again, better than nothing. Washington is in the medieval era. Okay. Uh, we need happiness. So, let's purchase. Not. Nah, gosh darn, I did it again. We need to buy these two tiles. Yes, yes, I'm fully aware that they're not happy and that I have tiles that can be worked. Okay, you're going to come over here, and you're the automated guy. You're going to come down here. Okay, build the plantation. We'll lose some production, but I'd rather have the happiness. Okay, I finished the market. Uh, build Chith and Itza. Ah, hurry up. Okay, so I'm going to check the Colossus. It gives plus one gold to work by the city. Okay, so just for the city. 
So it will give me a lot of gold. Like It won't give me as much as Machu, but Machu's production is way worse than the city's. So it's fine. And I'm getting 64 gold per turn. That's probably because I'm working the uh, National Wonder. 66. That I don't have a lot of military units either. But yeah, this is not going to be able to be a uh, militaristic game because I ha don't have enough raw materials. I have enough to keep the fences, but that's it. Alright, so we got my great engineer. Uh, we're going to send him over here because I would really like Machu Picchu. And it can only be built over in Machu, so that's kind or not in Machu, in uh, Tewaluku, not Machu, so that's kind of an unfortunate thing, but oh well. I'll be the farm. Choose production. Finished the granary, build the library. Alright, so this isn't going to help um, me a lot. And I actually have a nice amount of production, which I like. Three things. Heard everybody else. Okay, so you finished that. So, ye yeah, Machu Picchu. And we're going to go ahead and get you in here. Great production. Choose research. Um, education sounds good. Actually, no, because we are getting Machu Picchu, but we're going to want really large cities, so we're going to want the aqueduct. So how much am I getting from trade routes? 18? Okay. Great Wall has been built far away. So that should be roughly Three gold, 21 gold overall. Yep, 21 gold. That's good. Okay, sheep. Okay, finished Machu Picchu, and your production went terrible for some reason. Um, build a lighthouse because your sea tiles will be very effective, and we're just gonna go ahead and purchase the workboat. I hope that was the workboat. Yep, it was. Okay, good. Okay, adopt a policy. Uh, moving down this way. And we're going to go for kind of like a golden age based uh, strategy where we're just going to try to pop as many golden ages as possible. Which is another reason why um, it, it's, uh would be really, really nice because it'll it'll keep the amount of golden age length extremely long. So we're going to want a lot of gold so we can have a lot of happiness buildings. Okay, so you're done. Uh, the enemy is not near this city, so you can come over here and get this iron. Uh, this workboat this wants, should work this tile. And much you can range. Good. So we finished the library in Machu. Um, yeah, build the lighthouse next. So you're working on you're working on sea tiles, which is good. Moved out of range. It's fine. Ooh, even more fish. This one's out of range, but this one's not. Not what I wanted to click. Okay, sure, come down here. Farm. 70 gold per turn. Heck yes, I am... Uh, Mean, lean money machine. Okay. 
Fishing looks good. Let's see, do you have anything we want to purchase? Because we have money. Let's purchase the lighthouse. And uh, we're building the library, so we don't want to purchase that. How about, I think we're kind of low on money, but let's take a look over here. Building the lighthouse, so nothing. I am just dominating wonder production right now. You want cotton, cotton. Got two large resources and you want cotton. Ungrateful. Okay, production. Finish the library, build the market. Next turn. Instrumental or mechanical all right. science is the noblest and above all. Wait, you can others, build forts on map tiles now? They added. F I don't. I didn't know they had forts. They must have had that in some time in the past. Metal casting. Unmet player lost its capital. Holy cow! Wow, someone's being a warmonger in my place. That's that's amazing. Sweet chicken. It's a nice. So let's see. What do we want? Hagia Sophia is great. Agnar Watt would actually be fantastic because we do have a sh smaller amount of cities. Uh, first thing we're going to do though is build the aqueduct because that'll really help because you have seven turns to grow and six turns to build it. So that will really help the uh, per the increase in population in my capital, which would be great. Okay, you're done. We're going to go ahead and automate you. And we're going to automate you as well. Choose production. Finish the lighthouse. Build the... Well, we have enough money at the moment, so go ahead and just build the market. And because we can, I'm going to go ahead and upgrade one of my warriors to swordsman. And the other one will say other other um, iron will say for catapult if it ever comes to that. Finish the lighthouse over in Machu. Go ahead and build the aqueduct. Okay, so a bunch of stuff to Hiawatha has ended. You just fortify here. Let's talk to Hiawatha. What going on, Wero? Um, trade. Uh, you don't have a lot of stuff. Ivory for ten gold per turn. I'll give you my open borders too. Oh, fine. Okay. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and purchase a market here because it will give me a good amount of gold. Yeah, eight gold in the city. <whistles> that city is going to be my money maker. Print pieces of bronze or gold. Alright, so we got metal casting. Um, next we'll grab education. Five eighty. Four sixty for the aqueduct, okay. I'll go ahead and buy the workshop down here because it's not gonna have a ton of production. It will be pretty good, but not a ton, and I'm gonna want one any everywhere anyway. Okay, you can automate. Am I seriously running that low on happiness? Huh. Okay, Cusco. 
Um, we're going to wait on the National College, because I really would like both of these. Um, Agnar Watt a little bit more. They really nerfed Agnar Watt, um, because it'll help my borders grow, and because I have smaller... Yeah, sm uh, I, don't, I don't want to have a ton of cities. Large cities in population would be great. Plus, the Great Engineer Point would be good, so we're going to grab that. Machu actually could use the... I'm not sure if I have enough. Nope, not enough yet. He could use the workshop. More than anywhere else. So let's go ahead and purchase it in here. We're going to need to do something about my happiness. Oh, it's been built in a faraway land. Oh, bummer. Okay. Well, Hagia Sophia. It'll do the same thing that I wanted the other one to, to do anyway, which was to generate more great people. Ugh, my happiness is taking a dive. Okay, so you've finished the market. Build the workshop. And we're gonna... Actually, scratch that. We're gonna have you purchase the workshop. And instead, have you build the aqueduct? Now we're so low on happiness, we need to worry about happiness first. Coliseum. Education is the. Yeah, we're now unhappy. Okay, next, uh, get machinery. Finish the aqueduct, build the Colosseum. Oh, Hagia Sophia has been built on a faraway land, so both of them got built real fast. We got some gold out of it, which is fine. Good day. Oh, you've actually got a lot of gold now. Here, all of your gold. Actually, no. We're not going to do that. Um, we'll take all of your gold per turn, and I'll give you an ivory, and 40 gold. As well as a research agreement. Good, Very good, well. good. Hi, Watha. What going on? You have no gold. Probably because you're trading a lot of gold per turn to me, but... Oh, well. Okay, go ahead and build the workshop, just to help your production. Okay, choose production, finish the aqueduct, build the workshop. Policy. Um, theocracy. Yes, we are unhappy, so let's get that. Oh, that helps so much. So it was, it's now 23 unhappiness, so it dropped by 8, so it was up to over 30 unhappiness, which was terrible, terrible, terrible. Okay. So let's give her back to positive happiness. Well, I'm going to cut the video off here, so uh, thank you very much for watching, and God bless.